notifications. <clears throat> John Cena. What's up, Pokemon fans? I'm Professor K for Evolutionaries Gaming. We just got a donation on Twitch right now because this is happening on Twitch. Destroyer, was that Destroyer God again? Yes, it was. A $40 donation to start the video. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. He's already donated $90 in this. For those of you who don't know, I am currently on Twitch right now, streaming to our Twitch subscribers as a benefit of being a Twitch subscriber. I've been wanting for the longest time to give you guys more, and this was the best way I could think of. All of our Twitch subscribers that are here are part of a recording session right now, and we got Rebel Clash. It's here, it's early. Huge shout out to Pokemon, I mean the real TPCI, the Pokemon Company International, for once again being amazing partners and sending us Rebel Clash early. We've got this Elite Trainer Box that we're gonna be opening up here. We've got a booster, oh, there goes my tin. Wow. We, we got a booster box down here as well that'll be in another video. And we've also got two theme decks that will be in another video as well. So huge, immense shout out to Pokemon for allowing us not only to get this product, but also to be able to allow us to open it up this early with their permission. So again, I can't thank them enough. Incredible, incredible company to support the people that open their product and, and, and love their product. And the people who love Pokemon can now see this a little bit early. So again, bottom of my heart, Pokemon, great job. All right, so we're gonna be opening up this Rebel Clash Elite Trainer Box here first. Again, huge shout out to my subscribers. You guys don't even realize the insanity that has ensued in this stream. We've gotten gift subscribers left, right, and center. Like 40 some of them coming from a couple of people like Casey, uh, also Jaqua, Professor Josh. We've had donations, we've had bit bombs. Uh, it's all over the place. Oh my gosh, there goes my camera again. I'm, I'm too hyped, guys. I'm too hyped. I'm too hyped. I don't know what's happening right now. <laughs> All right. So, without any further ado, let's get into this. It's time for Rebel Clash. We got Caparaja here on the front. And, uh, you know, it wouldn't be an opening from Evolutionaries Gaming or from myself if I didn't read the back of the box. So, we're doing it live. Read in the back of the box. Galarian Pokemon are ready to rock. Rock out with new Pokemon. Crank it loud and blast the beats. You'll find Rebellion, Chaos, and Punk Attitude galore in the Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Rebel Clash expansion loaded with Pokemon V, including Toxtricity V, Double V, Bolton V, Sandaconda V, and more. You'll also find a handful of Pokemon V Max, including the final evolutions of all three. First Partners Plus. Copperaja VMAX and Dragapult VMAX. Yeah, Dragapult. That's gonna be good. Take to the stage and the streets with the Pokemon Sword, oh, the, the, the Sword and Shield Rebel Clash expansion. I threw a random Pokemon in there for some reason. I don't know why, because it wasn't there. As you guys know, Elite Trainer Boxes come with the same set of stuff every single time. We've got eight packs of Rebel Clash. We've got the dividers, we've got the sleeves, we got the dice, we got the um, Damage counter dice, we got poison counter, we got burn counter, we got energies, and we got our player's guide as well. Oh man, I love Elite Trainer Boxes. They are some of my, they are probably my most favorite product of everything that they put out. Not to mention too, you get some really awesome artwork on the inside of these. So we got Cinderace down there, we got Inteleon, we got, ah, we got Rillaboom and Toxtricity. There you go. Very cool, very cool. All right, we're gonna, I don't know, we'll pick that up later. <laughs> we got a player's guide, which you guys are probably all familiar with how this works. You know, you get a little bit of a, a description of the cards that are inside. We got uh, that, as well as a couple of strategy things, which I'm not gonna go too much detail over. You guys know the deal on this. I got a chat full of people that are waiting to see this. 50 people are currently watching right now. All subscribers ready to go, and I'm sure you guys are too. And there's your set list as well. How many cards are in this set? 209 cards in this set, guys. 209. So not the biggest set, but still pretty darn big. Not as big as Copperaja, though. Or at least VMAX Copperaja. All right, so we got the cardboard. I'm actually going to save this Elite Trainer box. I haven't saved enough of them recently, I don't think. What is this? 
This is new. I have not seen this before. This is a Pokemon trading card game rules book. Okay. So they got a rule book in here now. That's that's new. That's very new. Telling you how to play the game. I like this. I like this for brand new people even more so. Reasoning why Elite Trainer Boxes are some of the best products to buy for brand new people to the game. I like this a lot. This is awesome. Kudos, Pokemon. All right. So let's get into the rest of this here and then we'll open up our packs. So we got our uh, our code here for the Elite Trainer Box on the inside. Uh, you get the sleeves and everything else. You got your dividers featuring Caparaja. Two different yellows on either side. We got a pack of energy here as per the norm. Why they tease us with fairy energy still is beyond me. They're not bringing them back, so why are they still in here? I don't know. And then we got our pack of sleeves here as well for Caparaja. We got the yellow dice to match the yellow theme of these Elite Trainer Boxes here. We got our poison and burn counters as per the norm. And then we got our packs. We got eight packs of Rebel Clash. Ready to go. All right, I'm gonna adjust my camera down just a little bit here. I'm gonna have to pick up that tin before I do my next video. I can't believe I knocked that over. That was, ter that was terrible. That was terrible. I see a ton of gifted subs going out. What the heck? Did we go? We're over. Yo, you guys. I hate to I hate to break the fourth wall here, but we've actually hit the goal. Uh, we're over 150 subscribers now. We're talking 151. The original 151. Oh man, you guys in the Twitch chat, I love you guys. You're amazing. KC and Professor Josh just gifting subs away right now. I finally noticed. I know I said I wasn't gonna look at the chat, but I can't help it sometimes. <sighs> I swear, I, I swear, I have the best community of people. I really do. I really do. This channel has the best people, without a doubt. All right. You guys ready? Because I'm ready. It's time for Rebel Clash. First pack. We're going with Cinderace first. I'm going to do my very best, and I mean very best, to not give away any code cards at all whatsoever as far as like what they actually are. Uh, I'm really bad about that usually. I'm not gonna feel any cards. This is gonna be 100% shock value. KC said that was his goal. <laughs> that was their goal, I should say. And it happened. We got to 151. KC, Professor Josh, love you guys. All right, so the first cards of Rebel Clash start with Aracuda with Rain Splash. Check out that set symbol down there if you guys can see it. Uh, I can't fix the zoom too much more than I already have it, but it's better than it was last time I did this type of recording. We got Galarian Meowth with Evolution Roar. You must discard two cards from your hand in order to use this ability. Once during your turn, you may search your deck for a Galarian Berserker, reveal it, put it into your hand, and then shuffle your deck. That's a pretty cool looking card. We got Surskit with Agility. Magikarp with Leap Out. Look at that fat cheek Pikachu. <laughs> oh man, we got Metatites. Metapod, Yarn Metapod, Adaptive Evolution can evolve during your first turn. So we have that, that, that same chain of Caterpie Metapod Butterfree that we had, um, oh my gosh, when was it? It was a while ago with that, uh, that ability. Burning Scarf, if the Fire Pokemon this card is attached to was in the active spot and damaged by the opponent's attack, the attacking Pokemon is now burned, so welcome back again, burn. Oleana, uh, Oleana, 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 one or the other. Uh, you can play this card only if you discard two other cards from your hand. Your opponent reveals their hand. Put a trainer card you find there on the bottom of the deck. Cursed Shovel with some very skewed ink. That is very, very, um, bold. <laughs> if the Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out by damage from its attack, discard the top two cards of your opponent's deck. And then we have an Electivire with Thundershock and Electrified Bolt. Just a regular rare to start out our Rebel Clash journey. All right, let's go with Rillaboom up next. I am going to say, I I hope that didn't go in the camera. I hope that didn't go in the camera. I said I was going to try my best, and I kind of failed a little bit there. But uh, we got uh, we got to start here with Galarian Deramaka. <laughs> Probably going to get two or three Ultras out of this, I predict. Um, Ice Punch. Galarian Deramaka is actually really, really cool. I like how they just changed it from fire to ice. Very neat. Kind of like, obviously, Vul Vulpix and Ninetales. Uh, we got Bunnelby. Speaking of Vulpix, <laughs> there's another one. 
We got a Phantom. Galarian Farfetch'd. <laughs> Man, that is one angry looking Farfetch'd. He looks more like Surfetch'd in that than Farfetch'd. Curse Shovel again. Phalanx. Call for family and team attack. We got Palpitoad. Sigilyph. Uh, Counter-attack. If this Pokemon is in the active spot, damaged by opponent's attack, even if it's knocked out, put three damage counters on the attacking Pokemon. And a Sandaconda! Alright, so our very first Ultra of the set is Sandaconda V. I need to get some more sleeves over here. I have too much stuff in the way. <laughs> I got coffee, I got water, I got my mouse, my, my microphone, um, my, my microphone recorder. Everything's in the way. So Sandaconda V! Sand Eater and Sand Breath, 220 for that Sand Breath. Discard two energy from the Pokemon. Sand Eater, attach a fighting energy from your discard pile to this Pokemon. So that's pretty cool. It's kind of like a Landorus Shot of Power kind of deal there. Not too bad. All right, two packs. Two packs in, and we are one Ultra ahead. Oh, I did it again, darn it. Ah, I'm trying my best here, guys. I really am, but I'm failing. I'm failing. <laughs> uh, all right, we got coughing now. Poison types are now dark types in the TCG, so uh, that's why he's a dark type, obviously. We got a Shinx, a Galarian Yamask, so it's making its debut here as well. Applin, also. <laughs> Continuous tumble. Hatena, find a friend in Psyshot. Halucha! Oh, why is an N here right now? Spoiled it. I spoiled it. I know. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Alucha! Darn. I really wish he was here so I could make fun of him right now. NDD, Chargebug, Stonejourner, that's a uh, rare reverse, and Ice Q. So this is our first hollow of the set. Ice Q, Ice Face, if this, opponent, if this Pokemon has full HP, it takes 60 less damage from your opponent's attacks, and then Blizzard for 70 does 10 damage to each of your opponent's benched Pokemon. So Ice Cube making his debut here in the TCG as well. All right. Next up. Come on. I have to keep the back of the pack face towards you guys so I don't show that code card. And then if I put it down like this, I literally can't see what it is. So here we go. Energy card over there. All right. So we got Voltorb, Continuous Tumble, Growlithe, Treepy! All right. So quick attack is all this one has to start out with. We got a Snover, Binacle, Carcoal, we got Heatmore, Zatu, Energy Warp, and Psychic. All right, we got Toxel, Reverse Hollow Common, Tight Jaw, and Galarian Darmanitan. So we got Blizzard and Crushing Headbutt. Crushing Headbutt's pretty powerful, but it's definitely expensive, and you can only use it basically every other turn. All right, so we'll go to the next one here. And that over there. Okay. All right, we got another Dreepy. Galarian Farfetch'd. Hone Edge. Timpole. Vullaby. Sonya. All right, so search your deck for two basic Pokemon or up to two basic energy cards. Reveal them and put them into your hand, and then shuffle your deck. We got Pelipper. Bronzong. Heat more, reverse, and an Aegislash. Big shield, 30 less damage from your opponent's attacks. But you can't apply more than one big shield ability at a time. Three packs to go, and we have two hollows or better. There's got to be more. There's got to be something more. All right. So, in lieu of N not being here, we got Stuffle. Can't do it like he can. Lotad, Growlithe, Roly Coley. We got a Metatite, Lampant, top entry. Once during your turn, if you drew this Pokemon from your deck at the beginning of your turn and your bench isn't full, before you put it into your hand, you may put it onto your bench. What? So if the bench isn't full and you drew it from your deck at the beginning of your turn, how can you prove that you took it off your deck unless you really just do that. That's that might cause some issues. <laughs> Galar Mine. The retreat cost of both active Pokemon is two colorless energy more. We got a Bronzong, a Squavit. Weird looking Pokemon. And oh, 
Our first full art is a Malamar V. Malamar V. Drag off and brain shake. Your opponent's active is not confused. Switch one of your opponents benched with your active. It does 30 damage to the new active Pokemon. Look how, look how amazing this card looks, guys. Look at that artwork. Oh my gosh, this is great. Vile, I just caught you. Thank you for the 100 bits. Destroyer with another dollar donation. <laughs> Holy cow. You guys are amazing. I love you. Malamar V. That's two Ultras. All right. Can we get a third? We got two packs left to do it. We're at three out of eight. So, I mean, we're not guaranteed any more than that, but it'd be really nice. All right. So we got Milsery or Milkery, depending on which way you want to go with that pronunciation. I personally prefer Milsery. We've got Growlithe. Impidim V. V. I know you're here. You got your guy. You got your guy right here. Impidimp. <laughs> we got a Bunnelby. And my son, see, I knew he was here. We got a Phantom. Luxio. Another top entry. So you can do this as well with Luxio. Just like you do with Lampant. That's pretty neat. Dracloak. Summon. Search your deck for a Dreepy. Put it onto your bench. Then shuffle your deck. Bite for 40. Tranquil. Roly Coley. And Greedent. Greedy Tail, you may search your deck for a Pokemon tool card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Okay. Okay. Luxio does look nice. I agree. I agree. Alright, guys. Last pack of this Elite Trainer Box. Here we go. We got Squavit, Galarian Mr. Mime, Caterpie, Barboach, Aracuda, Capture Energy. That's a new one. So as long as this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides colorless energy. When you attach this card from your hand to a Pokemon, search your deck for a basic Pokemon, put it onto your bench, and then shuffle your deck. We got a chat out here with Lucky Match. When you play this Pokemon from your hand, you flip a coin. If heads, put a supporter card from your discard into your hand. Dracloak. Wingle. Lots of Wingles in that picture. And our final card for this Elite Trainer Box is a Sigilyph. All right, that was kind of counter... <laughs> I started to say counter-attack. Uh, that's not the word I was going for. What was I trying to go for? Anticlimactic, not counter. Uh, that's what happens when you try to read something and say something at the same time. Oh, well. Nonetheless, though, we still did manage to get a Hollow and two Ultra Rares. We got Sandicana, we got Malamar, and we got Ice Q. So that's pretty cool anyways. I mean, I've seen the Elite Trainer Boxes with nothing in them, so you can't be too mad about that. That's for sure. We got Casey out here gifting more subs away. What is happening? Oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys are missing out if you're not part of the Twitch chat for our recording sessions. I've had more fun and more interaction with the chat in these recording streams that I've been doing than any other stream that I've had like regular Friday night stream, and I've never had more fun recording videos in the six, almost six years that I've been doing YouTube. This is something I should have been doing since day one, and I'm so upset that I didn't, and that I haven't, but we're doing it now. You guys are missing out if you're not here, if you're watching this on YouTube. Twitch subscribers get the opportunity to be part of this now. The chat is going nuts. It's amazing. You guys, really, it truly is. So again, shout out to Pokemon for this Elite Trainer Box. We got the Booster Box coming up very soon as well. So make sure you guys uh, stay tuned for that um, on YouTube, of course. If you guys don't follow us on Twitch, twitch.tv slash evolutionariesgaming. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Comment down below. Subscribe for more TCG content. Plenty more Rebel Clash on the way. This is just the beginning. We are just at the tip of the ice queue. Oh, man, that was bad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ugh, oh, puns. Anyways. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Take care and have a great day.